Okay, so again, good day and welcome to our lesson. Our lesson, it's all about embracing your diversity. But before anything else, let's discuss module one, understanding diversity. We will going to define what is diversity and discuss the long dense diversity. For our topic learning outcome, the students or you should be able to discuss the meaning and significance of diversity and demonstrate the use of Luden's wells of diversity. So before anything else, let us discuss what do, we, what do we mean by the word diversity? So when we say diversity, it's differences. Diversity is the differences in racial and ethnic, socioeconomic, geographic, and academic professional backgrounds, meaning it discusses the differences in individual in terms of their race, race, ethnic, the socioeconomic, geographic, academic, and professional backgrounds. Also, it talks about the people with different opinions, different backgrounds. The backgrounds includes the degrees and social experiences, religious beliefs, political beliefs, sexual orientations, heritage, and life experiences. So, for example, in our school, we are surrounded with diverse students. When we say diverse, coming with, from, or having different opinions, backgrounds. So, for example, in my, in my PowerPoint, as you can see in the picture, we can see that there is the ingredients for making cake. So we have eggs, flour. So meaning in preparing a cake, there are diverse ingredients. Now, according to, to the words of Carly Hodes, it is said that diversity refers to the people often relate diversity to race and sometimes even in gender and more recently in sexual orientation. So diversity we learn from other people with um, our success depends on the different diverse people. Okay, so also the word inclusion and diversity is inseparable. So what do you mean by the word inclusion? Inclusion means it involves bringing together and harnessing diverse forces and resources in a way that is beneficial. Meaning inclusion puts the concepts and practice of diversity into actions by creating an environment of involvement, respect, and connection. Meaning inclusion, it's the putting of concepts of diversity. Also, with that connection, where the richness of our ideas, backgrounds, and perspectives are harnessed to create business value and overall success. So for example, in my picture, we can see that inclusion is the one making the mix work, okay? While diversity is our ingredients in making cake, inclusion man is the one we are going to mix for work. So what are the difference between diversity and inclusion? Diversity is simply the representation of many different types of people, such as gender, race, ability, religion, and etc. Also, diversity focuses on the differences. So as I said in our example, referred to as the mix. While well, inclusion is the deliberate act of welcoming diversity and creating an environment where all different kinds of people can thrive and succeed, meaning it's welcoming or putting diversity and after that, creating an environment where all diverse can thrive and succeed. So as I, as I said, based on the illustration, inclusion meaning making the mix work. So diversity is what you have, inclusion is what you do. So another example is simply having a diverse group team, workforce, classroom, etc. is not enough. Why? Everyone should feel safe and encouraged to fully separate or participate and shape and be on equal footing as everyone else. So that's what we call inclusion, meaning it's the application of diversity. So it's not only referring to the different types of people surrounded with different types of people, but how do we going to accept them to feel safe? So there is a question, why does diversity matter in you as a student? So I have here, I have here some points. Number one, 
it said that diversity expands your worldliness, meaning you might be the first time you have had the opportunity to have a real interaction with people from diverse groups. And it's nice to know or to see other people with different culture, with different backgrounds. Second is diversity enhances your social development, meaning interacting with other people from a variety of groups widen your special circle by expanding the pool of people with whom you can associate and, and develop your relationship. Meaning when you uh, encountered other people, it enhances your social development. Meaning it is the one shaping your attitude and your rapport to other people. Third, we have diversity prepare students for future career success, meaning successful performance in today's diverse workforce requires sensitivity to human differences and the ability to relate to people from different cultural backgrounds, meaning diversity also prepares you for your career success, meaning on how you handle different types of attitudes of people, how it will shape your values, in looking or talking to other people. Remember, we have individual differences. So it's nice that you will be encountered with different attitude with different people. Number four, diversity also prepares students for work in a global society. No, meaning, no matter what your profession is or no matter what profession you enter, you'll find yourself working with people, meaning your employers, employees, co-workers, customers, and clients from diverse backgrounds worldwide. Number five, interactions with people different from ourselves increase your knowledge base. As I said, it is related with number four that uh, it will mold you to become a better person. Number six, diversity also promotes creative thinking, meaning diversity expands your capacity for viewing issues or problems from multiple perspectives, angles, and vantage points, meaning it will make you creative when you will encounter with other people. Number seven, diversity enhances your self-awareness, meaning learning from people whose backgrounds and experiences differ from your own, sharpens your knowledge and self-insights by allowing you to compare and contrast your life experiences with others whose life experiences differ sharply from your own. Meaning listening from others, especially advices, the one that who is older from you and the one who is more experienced than you is a great thing that will enhance your self-awareness. Number eight, diversity also enriches the multiple perspectives developed by liberal arts of education. So how to embrace your diversity? Number one, everyone's narrative, okay? So meaning considering your own life and everything that shaped your beliefs. Number two, where are you coming from? Befriend all people. You should have the empathy. Actively accept and show compassion. So with this, uh, this is our module one and I hope you enjoy our video. And later on, I will be uploading also the low dense role of diversity. So God bless and good day everyone.